dance really well. We are going on a wedding. But we are not invited. But it's a special day here in India. It's got all special day. And it's a day where all of the India is having so many weddings. And we are on the one. It's Manshi and Aman, as it's I a, can see. It's a huge one. Here. We are dressed up like Indians. I have yeah. kurta. Yeah, I have a sad Indian sari. And one lady, she tried to do my makeup, which was not that successful. But here we are. <laughs> We're gonna give it a try and see how traditional Indian wedding looks like. We just like guys. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. This is huge. <laughs> this is huge. We've been greeted by a manager and he said that yeah, no problem, we can go inside. And then we've met the bride's father. Bride's father. He, he took a lovely. photo with us. <laughs> Yeah, he welcomed us so warmly, it's so nice. Like a family. Because so. we felt strange in the beginning, everybody was looking at us, but after, it, it's feeling really good to be here. Yes, and the wedding has not yet started because it starts with Bharat, which is like a ceremony oh, where the yes, groom yes. is going with a big reception. <laughs> We just attended the crazy bar at the welcoming party. I got these gifts. One hour now until the bride arrives. So we're gonna feast on these fruits and Indian foods. Yeah, I guess the plan is clear. <laughs> but the wedding is looking really nice. There's like 500 people, which means that it's not that big wedding. Say hi, guys. Hi. Oh, everyone is really friendly. Friendly here. They accepted us like one of their family. Are you a vlogger? Yes. It's crazy! There are two food courts and the second one is the other side. There's so much food here. But the wedding is so crazy. Yeah, it actually starts at one or two, but it's already like wow, crazy. People dancing there, eating there, so much stuff going on. Yeah, you can hear music from one corner, different music from another corner. Yes, and they're different from the entrance. Woo, it's wild. Yeah. <laughs> Like we are on some kind of festival. There's people everywhere. What's your name? My name is Keisha Sharma. Nice to meet you, Keisha. Thank you. और कहा है कि आपकी झीरी में जाएंगी ताबिश भाई के नारजे की चिंता और आज आप लग रही हैं पीटी चिंता जैसी प्यारी आप उससे कम प्यारा पाना आपके लिए. What is it? I don't know. It was 
at this moment that he knew he fucked up. We just had something terrible. No! Never again. It tastes like toothpaste, like when you go to spa and... Imagine licking uh, walls in spa. <laughs> That's it. With some strange seas, rocks inside. Now it's like leaf with iron. And you can't chew it. No, 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 no. no. We've seen it once, but no, never again. We're gonna try something better, not this thing. The bride is already coming. She's gonna be so shocked when she sees us. I was really surprised like how few guests really paid attention to the ceremony. It was maybe like 100 people from all the 500 that really looked at the ceremony and the others were just eating, dancing, talking or sitting somewhere else and not even seeing the bride and their beautiful moments. That's a shame, but the ceremony really nice. We enjoyed it a lot. Round number two. Because the food is too good. They are actually all vegetarians, but the food is prepared so amazing with the spices and everything. We don't need the meat here. The vegetarian meat dishes are prepared really well. There's also ice cream sticks, like coolfish, which I had before. She had it, I love it. I'm gonna give them a try. Thank you. Maria <laughs> After dancing, <laughs> <laughs> after dancing, we're gonna get something to drink. No, <laughs> we found out that the. Oh, we're not sure if the wedding is over or not because from the 500 people that were here, there are like 80. 80, maximum 100 left. The music stopped. The people are scattered somewhere else, but they're just making selfies with us. Yeah, they're <laughs> taking a photo, a lot of photos with us. The bride is still taking photos by the altar, but we're not sure if the wedding is over or if it's gonna happen anything. Because the food is still here. Food is still here. It's not even midnight. Oh, it's not like yeah, that's maybe just the beginning of the wedding. But here, we're not sure. We'll see. Thank you. Okay. So the wedding didn't end yet. The party stopped. The music stopped. The dancers went home. Actually, a lot of people went home to change. Yeah. And what's gonna happen now is that from like half uh, to 12 till 1, it's nothing going on. You just can eat and drink and uh, socialize. And uh, at 1, there's gonna be another ceremony where they will be doing something. So it's not like that they have a party for three days. Different ceremonies, different times of day because of the astrological composition. I don't know what. As the wedding is quite long, some people are already sleeping there, waiting for the other ceremonies. And this is how quiet the wedding is. It's really something unusual for us because at this time of the hour in Slovakia... We are drunk. <laughs> and people are dancing. Yeah, and that's the fact that here on this wedding there is no meat and there is not a single drop of alcohol. So we are waiting for the ceremony, which will start in maybe an hour. And the ceremony is called? The Shadi and like uh, bride and groom will, sit, will be seated around the fire, at the fire's fire and there will, all the rituals will happen over there. And in that there will be fairy. The fairy is like uh, taking round, like around seven rounds. Mm -hmm. 
and the second ceremony will start at like four or five in the morning. Yeah, that is called Bidai. So Bidai. when the bride, the girl, leaves her parents home for her and knows her. Okay. So that's okay. all. Thank you so very much. It's an emotional moment. Okay. Yeah, it's very emotional. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the explanation. Quite a bad news. We found out that uh, actually these ceremonies are too intimate and are just for a family and really really close friends. Yes, it's like the closest group of, group of people that attend these ceremonies because of the religious reasons. So we decided not to violate the wishes of the family and the close members and decided to leave to keep the traditions traditions and because we are foreigners we don't want to... Yeah, actually at the end we were just visiting the wedding we were not invited to yeah, yeah, yeah. and it was actually so nice that they, that they took us like yeah. they're so... There are still much more ceremonies that are going on but unfortunately we are not close part of the family so we are not able to witness them so this was an invited visit to an Indian wedding you see it's possible the people are really welcoming they accepted us really well as their own we felt like at our family's wedding everyone was just asking if we had dinner like 20 times if we have enough to drink it was really nice of them I enjoyed it a lot yeah me too and actually if you ever had a chance to attend an Indian wedding do it because it's an experience for a lifetime Time for me it's different than uh, the weddings that we are used to back in Slovakia or in uh, Europe or the Western countries but definitely interesting and a really good experience so this is all from this wedding we'll come with another interesting ideas to show you another cultures in another countries but for this video that's all for you friends and with this we're going to get a tuk-tuk and go to sleep, sleep. Yeah. so Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you Indian people for having us. It was amazing. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Bye.